Hello everybody, this is Dr. McBrick and I am here with a Friends set, set 41332, Emma's Art Stand. It's 210 pieces and I picked this up at the store. It was on sale at my local grocery store for $9.99 and I looked at all the different pieces here and I thought it would go very well in my amusement park, in my carnival area. So um, I picked it up and uh, I'm going to build it. First, I'll build it like it's supposed to be built, and then I will modify it for my Six Figs over Figsdale amusement park. So, let's get started with the speed build. Okay, we are back with the Emma's Art Stand uh, set, 41332. It's a Legos Friend set, and as I said before, I picked it up for $9.99 at my local grocery store. It was on sale. I think this is a new set, actually, and I think it regularly retails for either $14.99 or $19.99. I'm not sure. But I got it really for the parts because there's some cool parts and some cool stickers and stuff in there, and I am going to use it for my theme park, my amusement park. So let's take a look. I'll detach. As you see, it comes with a, it's a um, little, little cart that Emma on her little motor scooter pulls. And boy, I tell you, that's a big, hefty thing to be pulling on that little motor scooter, Emma. Um, <laughs> so, I mean, she could jackknife that puppy real quick. Um, anyway, uh, that could, seems like that could get away from that little motor scooter, but she can pull it and everything like that. So I will detach her and take it off. And if you notice right here, we'll show you a little bit about Emma. It comes with a cute little kitty right there, and the kitty has a little bow on her head. Um, isn't that cute? That little kitty is just cute. Uh, it comes with Emma. Of course, it's Emma's art stand, um, so it should come with Emma, um, who is a wonderful creator and artist. Um, so that's the mini doll Emma. Only comes with one mini doll. Has that nice uh, rubberized hair piece there that can be used on mini dolls or mini figs. Um, and then, of course, it comes with this really cool scooter. And uh, I like. Let me try to contrast it there. There, I like this scooter. Um, I love the color of it. Of course, you can use mini figs for this scooter as well. They would work perfectly as well. Um, and it's just a really cool scooter. Uh, I love the color and everything like that. So it comes with that. The other thing that it comes with is this nice little art easel right here. Um, and if you uh, can see, it has a nice tree, a little suggestion of a tree there, a little plant, or a little uh, um, rose, uh, and a flower and things like that. It has a stool on which Emma can sit, or the, I'm sorry, in which the uh, person can sit, and Emma can draw pictures of you. Now, there's not five stools here, but there's five people here, so I'm not sure what she's drawing there, but uh, um, I, <laughs> it looks almost kind of like the Mount Rushmore of Friends, uh, if you want to know, be honest there. Um, anyway, this is a really nice little easel, very simple, very simple build that you saw in the speed build there. It's basically one of those big Y type of pieces, um, and uh, one of these with a sticker. Everything is a sticker in this except for one thing that I will show you um, that's more of a standard part. Um, but uh, this sticker is cool, and that's one of the things I bought this set for was it comes with all of these cool art stickers. So um, in my Six Figs over Figsdale Amusement Park, I'm planning on making this into a little art cart, um, just like they have in the, uh, in the amusement parks. So anyway, and there's a nice little marker and uh, um, paint marker and things like that. So that's that. Now, let's take a look at the main product of this particular build here. As you see, it is an art cart, and it's completely self-contained. Has a wonderful, oops, wonderful little uh, window there. Um, nice big window so you can see into the art cart on all sides. Um, it has a, a couple of things. There's a little paw print right there. That's a uh, print on the uh, uh, one by um, that's round, and we've seen that before. A nice little paw print comes with a lot of the, the friend stuff. And on this side is a helmet, and that's the helmet that Emma should have been wearing when she was pulling this big thing, but she wasn't because it was in there. So I guess that's a uh, foul, isn't it? Um, anyway, you can open, oh, well, you, you can open these up. The idea is that you're supposed to be able to open these up, right? Um, you can open these very gently, and this will open the art cart for 
the day. She can take this to the park, she can take it to the amusement park, whatever, but it is really cool. And um, let me just bring it forward here so you can see all of the artwork. As you see those stickers, and so this is just some stuff that, you know, as a creator, as an artist, she would definitely um, be creating as people would come by and uh, she would make these paintings and uh, that sort of thing for people. So I just think it's really cool. I like the way it swings in um, and it, it closes up. It comes with this nice printed mug here that says, I love HLC. Now I imagine that stands for Heart Lake. Um, but uh, the other thing is, if you happen to have initials, that are HLC. For instance, if you're Harold Larry Clark um, or Heather Louise Clark, that would be great. You'd have your own private mug, right? Um, your own personalized mug. Uh, so anyway, the roof does come off um, and it comes off just in a modular fashion with jumpers. So that gives you a little more light in there you can see. Um, so that is a printed piece, that mug. This is a printed piece right here, this printed two by two tile. Um, this is just a nice little bow stand. This of course is a printed slope for the cash register, the Friends brand of cash register that has the pink buttons on it. It comes with a hundred dollar bill as standard currency in the Lego world and a coin there. On the inside you see there again is that paw sticker and that helmet. There's enough room for about two minifigures or two um, mini dolls. So it, it, it's actually pretty cool. The roof itself is very nice. It's done with slopes as always. It has one of these things on it here to put this sign up so the sign can really turn anywhere as you see made by Emma um, and her art studio. Uh, so it is actually a nice little build. It was a very simple build. There's only 210 pieces in this particular set. Um, very quick to build, I would say. Um, it does say from ages six to 12, but I would say that even younger could probably build this set. Maybe not, they couldn't do the stickers. They need some uh, uh, grown up help with the stickers, but I think anyone could really build this set. Um, it is a, uh, a really, a really cool set. Pretty simple build on the wheels, all that kind of stuff. Um, I'm gonna modify it for my park um, and probably take off the wheels and make it a stationary stand. I'm not sure, I'm not sure how I'm gonna do it. Oh yeah, the other thing that happens here is look at this. This comes open. So you can go in here and you can have easy access for play. Um, and that is really, really cool. So, whoa, so that gives you uh, um, easy access for play in there to put your mini dolls or your um, mini figures in there. Uh, and then you can close it up Emma's going home for the day. Bye-bye, Emma. Time to go home. Um, let's see here. Close it up and uh, put everything back together. Um, and uh, let's see here. There we go. All right. And then we'll bring the scooter back over here. And once again, Emma has forgotten her helmet. She is not safety conscious. Make sure if you're watching this at home, you wear a helmet when you're on a motor scooter. And um, this motor scooter has some serious some serious horsepower because it's able to pull this big trailer. Anyway, that is Emma's Art Stand, 210 pieces set for one, three, three, two. Hope you enjoyed it. And it has some great pieces in which you can use in your own Lego collection if you don't want to do anything with the, uh, the, the stand itself. It has some cool pieces to use, some window pieces. Of course, those nice, uh, I, I don't know what the official color is, but they're not teal, but they're that really kind of light bluish type of color um, that's kind of a 50s-ish type of color. Love that. A lot of cool stickers you could always use um, and, and some good pieces. Uh, really cheap too, um, especially if you can get it on, on a discount like I did for $9.99. Um, that's what I try to do with my friend sets is I buy them and then I use them as pieces and parts for other sets and, and uh, some of the friend sets are just really cool. So with that said, I want to let you know that I am a proud member of the BrickTubers Network and the BrickTubers Network can be found in the link at the description on this video. So please check us out. Um, there were a bunch of brick tubers that just enjoy having fun and putting our stuff up on the web uh, and uh, um, on YouTube. So anyway, <laughs> see, see how old I am? I use the term web. Um, anyway, this is Dr. McBrick. I'm gonna sign off for the web now. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.